Nomad, this is Bowman. Been a long time. You probably weren't expecting to go back to Aroa so soon. Let me set the scene. The U.S. Army never landed. Ships have been deployed to blockade the archipelago's perimeter. Every major nation is represented, with fingers on the trigger for whoever dares to claim control over Aroa's technological resources. Sounds like a grand old tropical paradise, doesn't it? The CIA's been covertly working with the outcasts and their leader Haruhi Ito to declare Aroa a free and autonomous nation. Our solution? We send the ghosts to deal with the inevitable sentinel resistance that'll arise while leaving no trace of our involvement. You, old friend, will help the outcasts win their independence. Feel fancy yet? We do this right, and maybe we won't have another motherfucking shit show like Bolivia. Clearing up all that shaved a decade off my already charmed existence. I don't care for a repeat. Operation Motherland will begin the moment you meet up with Ito at the outcast camp. Good luck. Win Aroa her future. And try not to get killed. Bowman, it's Nomad. Got in. Surprisingly, you missed this place. Over. It's great to be working with you again, Nomad. Good times. New day, same old shit. Stay undetected while you make your way to Ito and the outcasts. Liberation should be easy with Sentinel and the Wolves leaderless and exhausted. The good news is, building an independent Aroa will be a breeze now that all parties have given the green light, including Skell's blessing. The only condition Ito gave to the CIA was that you be involved with the transition. Be discreet. U.S. forces cannot be seen on a Rowan soil. Great to be back in action, Bowman. The outcast main base is nearby. Do a recon before heading to the base. There's an observation point just in front of you. That way you can better plan your approach. Observation point, the outcast camp's been attacked. A lot of dead. The place is still crawling with enemies. Fucking Sentinel. Continue the recon without leaving the observation point. You can't reveal your presence. We need to find Ito. Bodarks for Black Ops. This situation's new and dangerous. Ito's place is surrounded by bodies. This was the epicenter of the fight. They must have come to capture Ito. Dead outcasts. This was a cruel attack with a lot of casualties. Jesus, that soldier's near invisible. Last time I saw this was in Bolivia. They're a real complication. But you should be able to see them using thermal vision. Find Ito. She's not here. If they got her or too many outcasts die, conquest will be impossible. It's looking more and more like Operation Motherland is compromised. I gotta find Ito. Can't let her down. Fine, but if Ito is dead, you have to escape Aroa before it falls. And if she's alive? We'll have to wait and see. First, secure the outcast camp. It's the only way to find intel on what happened to Ito. Copy. Nomad out. Good boss. Nice. 
started shooting. shooting. vision on. That was the last of them. Oh, this is Nomad. The outcast camp is secure. No trace of Vito, dead or alive. We'll proceed with caution, but if Ido is dead, the only option will be for us to retreat. 
Your main objective is to conquer the region and save Ito. Start striking at the boat arcs you find. It's clear that they've invaded the island, and they are our most pressing obstacles. There are several destabilization missions to support the primary objective. You can attack and destroy some Bodark VHC to reduce the Bodark's drone presence in the region. There's also a prison where captured outcasts have been gathered. If you free them, you might get intel on Ito, and simultaneously have possible reinforcements when the time comes to claim the region. Besides, the Bodarks unsurprisingly control the parliament. Securing the Bodark checkpoint adjacent to it should encourage the outcasts to unite once and for all and push them to fight. I'm on it. No matter.